Hey Monsies, 2019 San Diego Comic Con is finally here. NECA has revealed the next two Godzilla figures that will be released in their series. First up, we have the Fire Godzilla variant from Godzilla King of the Monsters. It doesn't look like there's any changes to this figure from the Godzilla we already have. It's just a, a complete new paint job. If it looks anything like this prototype, then that is great. I wasn't too happy with how the first Godzilla King of the Monsters figure turned out. The paint job on that was pretty good overall, but the eyes were so sloppy. Hopefully they get this done right. I don't think Fire Godzilla was that much of a surprise to anybody to be announced. We already knew it wasn't going to be King Ghidorah. A lot of people were probably hoping for that, but NECA already said they, they can't make a King Ghidorah figure in the price range that people want. It's unfortunate, but if anything, I was actually thinking that they, maybe they were going to do the Muto or one of the other new Kaiju that we saw hinted at or glimpsed at in the new film. So I'm a little disappointed that we didn't get any of the new original characters, but this looks great. In addition to this Godzilla King of the Monsters figure, we're also getting 1964's Mothra vs. Godzilla. Godzilla. Now we actually have some official promo images for this here. I can already tell people are going to be criticizing this. I remember whenever the prototype for the 1984 Godzilla came out, the head was so small, there was just no words to describe how it looked. This doesn't look nearly as bad as the original 1984 prototype, but there's still something off about the way his face looks. Maybe it's the upper part of his snout isn't large enough. I'm not quite sure what they're missing with this one. What do you guys think of this here? Can you pinpoint exactly what is wrong with this? Also, maybe the arms on this figure are a little bit too fat for 1964 Godzilla. I don't know. I like it as its own figure. It's I wouldn't say it's very accurate. We've had a few figures in the past where NECA and Monster Arts were compared. This fails in comparison to Monster Arts 1964 version. This 1964 Godzilla is expected to release in November of this year. All right, Monsties, are you guys gonna keep collecting these? You think this is better than nothing? Personally, I, I like it with a little bit of variant. It gives it its own original appearance. But then again, maybe that's because I grew up in the Trend Masters era where the figures weren't that accurate. You could look at them and say, hey, that's Godzilla. I don't know what era is supposed to represent, but it's Godzilla. And maybe because I'm used to that, I'm okay with this. All right, Musties, thanks for watching.